Welcome to my 7 a.m. morning routine. Just so you know, I do not wake up at 7 a.m. every single day. I sadly refuse to wake up anytime before 7 a.m. But I do this routine maybe twice a week. Currently 8 a.m. I kind of just spent this morning just to relax, make myself a little snack, and then made some coffee. And then right now, I'm just going to check some emails and look at the content ahead. But yeah, um, I'm just going to take you guys along with me in my productive morning. If you guys like this type of content, please comment down below so I can make more. It's just a full plain black gym shirt outfit and then I'm just gonna wear this little shirt over it. currently like 9 in the morning and I just got ready to go to the gym. I literally spent the first few hours just, just replying some emails, getting some work done, submit a video for approval this morning and I just kind of wanted to get it over with but I finally uploaded the video. It's 9 a.m. so I'm kind of just using this jade roller to deep off. gym and I got my green juice. This is Sweet Greens by Pratt and honestly it tastes really really good. It's just it doesn't taste as healthy as you think it'd be. It looks really green and really intimidating but honestly it's really sweet and really refreshing. That's why I love it. So for breakfast I'm just having some overnight oats I made last night. Insert the clip. So we're gonna prep making some overnight oats today. Half a cup of oats. Fill it up with oat milk, just enough until it kind of covers all the oats. I then usually go in with like one tablespoon of yogurt. And then I kind of just add one teaspoon of chia seeds. I've recently started doing this, but I'm just gonna try and like eyeball this. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite ingredient. I always add peanut butter to my overnight oats because I like eating it with bananas. I just do one teaspoon. This is just gonna add a little bit of flavor. Finally, I literally just like shake it. This usually works. I kind of just leave this in the fridge overnight and then next morning you're ready to eat. Super easy, super good, amazing love. So I just washed my hair and I just want to come in here to kind of explain to you products I kind of use my hair every time I wash it. So the first thing I do every time I wash my hair is I, I go in with this ordinary hair care serum. 
I've been doing this for like about a year and I just put this on the scalp or the areas that I feel like I want a little bit more hair density. So this is usually like the hairline, where my baby hairs are. And I just kind of massage that into my scalp. I just kind of do this, kind of massage my scalp for like not that long, probably like a minute. I then go in with my hair oil. So my favorite hair oil is this Sukin hair oil. I've been using their products for over like two years and it's an Australian brand. And my mom actually got it for me from the pharmacist. For as long as I can remember actually, I've been using this for a really long time. I've been using this brand for about five years, I guess. And they just have a bunch of like really like clean, healthy products in their skincare and hair care. So I only use their shampoos. I only use their products because I kind of trust it. But I kind of run this hair oil all over because my my hair gets really frizzy really quickly. I then go in with my Dyson and I just kind of blow dry my hair until it's like 70% dry. I then go in with the brush attachment and I just kind of like brush out my hair to get rid of any frizz. And then I just kind of go in with the thickest barrel and I kind of give myself a little blowout kind of look. I've been loving this look recently because my hair is at this length where it needs to be styled because it's getting a bit long. I've also been reminding myself to use heat protectant right before I go in with anything. Okay, so my hair is dry, but I just wanted to show you guys my skincare routine. Usually, I would do my skincare right before I blow dry my hair. I wanted to look a little bit more presentable for this video because I am going to introduce you guys to the sponsor of this video. So thank you, Skin and Me, for sponsoring this portion of the video. I wanted to briefly thank them so much for sending me my personalized daily doser. So what is Skin and Me? It's basically a personalized skincare brand that curates products designed by dermatologists, made for your skin. And I love how this personal treatment is designed for you. Like you actually have to fill up a pretty in-depth consultation. So they're really specific. Everyone's products are more or less a little bit different because it just depends on your consultation as well. They curate a concoction for you based on your skin and based on your consultation. You also have to list down the goals that you want for your skin. So for me, my goals is pretty simple. I rarely ever break out, but I just wanted my skin to look really healthy, youthful, glowy, and just kind of give my skin some life back into it. So this is my little concoction. It's very fun. And what I like about Skin and Me is that this little daily doser thing, you just have to twist it like this until you hear the click and literally that's how much you need for your skin I love this so much because I don't have to think too much about like am I using too much product and I just kind of know how much product is meant for my skin and how long until I have left to replace it and I believe they do like subscription services which I think is really unique what I really love about this is just the convenience of everything like I just love how I can just twist it up without thinking too much know how much I'm using so I think that's really useful so a few key facts about a daily doser they are super convenient you can receive one through an online consultation which can be done through your phone which is super fast and super quick and your daily doser will arrive a few days after the daily dosers are bottled up with exactly the right amount of personal nice solution to last you through the whole month. Every twist and click gives you your daily dose that's not too much or not too little. This is super helpful because you kind of know more or less when your product is going to finish. And also because it is a subscription, your next daily doser will arrive direct to your door just as you're about to finish your last one. Packaging is also minimal, fully recyclable, and small enough to fit through your letterbox. So you're probably not going to have any issues of it being re-delivered even if you're not home. They use fully recyclable packaging and their formulas are also vegan friendly I believe. The products are made to order which I think is so amazing. So yes, if you guys want to Try skin and me. I'll have my link linked down below. You can get your first personalized daily doser for $3.50 instead of $24.99, which I think is a big deal. Just saying. I also have a code for you guys. So my code is Elena Fab. If you guys want to use it, thank you so much, skin and me, for reaching out to me. And let's get on with the rest of my skincare. I just go in with my Sukin Oil Free Moisturizer. Always, always, always use SPF. Even in the UK when there's barely any sun, I still don't feel right going out without SPF. Just do it guys, trust me, just do it. Like SPF really changed my skin so much. I use La Roche Posay sunscreen. It's a little bit more on the higher end side, but I feel like it's the only consistency that really works for me. It leaves my skin looking super glowy, so I love I love using this product right before my makeup and I always just rub the excess off my neck. But yeah, this is the finished skincare routine. My camera is about to die, but I'm just gonna do some light makeup before I head off today. Makeup done. So I just did some eyeliner and some lipstick. 
I'm basically just gonna get changed and I'm gonna head off to the study center to get some work done. I decided to get out of my comfort zone and do something really, really fun. I forgot my lip liner. If you guys enjoyed this type of videos, do not forget to give it a thumbs up and I will definitely make more of these. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.